Man, this stinks. Since the restroom is completely out of order and I didn't even get a chance to wash my hands there, I am going to wash my hands in the water fountain so that the people can get a taste of my own medicine. Oh my god, suck up at Amaravati. How freaking dare you wash your hands in the water fountain? You know that people are going to get sick or killed if they use this water fountain because you spread your germs all over it. That is so it, since you need to be disciplined, I am going to kick you in the back right now for what you did to the water fountain. You don't ever wash your hands in the water fountain again. Do you understand me missy? You know that you could have gotten people sick or killed if they were to drink that fountain. That is so it right now. You are coming with me to the principal's office right now. Why hello there Mazichika. What brings you and sock puppet Amaravati into my office today? Well. As I was walking to use the women's and girls' bathroom, I saw Sock Puppet Amaravati washing her hands in the water fountain just because the restroom is out of order. This made me so pissed off and furious that I kicked her in the back. Oh my god Sock Puppet Amaravati! How freaking dare you wash your hands in the water fountain! You know that people are going to get sick or killed if they use this water fountain because you spread your germs all over it. That is so it. You are hereby expelled from this school severely. Go home right now and I will call your parents and your guardians when I tell them about this situation. Ichiku Akamine, you are not off the hook either. We don't ever put on our hands on the other students or anyone else. I understand that you wanted to discipline sock puppet Amaravati for her actions, but violence like this is never the answer under any unforeseen circumstances. That's so it. I have no other choice than to fire you from your school at the Go City Beyond Academy. No. You can't do this to me. I'm really sorry about my actions today. I was just pissed off at Sarpap at Amaravati for her actions. Please give me another chance and I promise that I will be good next time. I'm sorry Ichika, but you should have thought of that before you had the goddamn audacity to go all crazy and kick Sock Puppet Amaravati in the back. Get out of this building and go home right now before I contact the police. No 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 God fucking damn it sock puppet Damravati. How freaking dare you get expelled from school severely for washing your hands in the water fountain. You know that people are going to get sick or killed if they use this water fountain because you spread your germs all over it. Thanks to you, nobody else can use the water fountain at school until the school's janitor can get your germs cleaned up from that goddamn water fountain. Sat Puppet Amaravati, we hope that you are happy with all of this. What do you have to say for yourself for all of this nonsense today? Um, I didn't even mean to spread germs all over the water fountain. I was just mad because the bathrooms are out of order and I didn't get a chance to wash my hands at the sink. So that is why I had the goddamn audacity to wash my hands in the water fountain. Well, that is not an excuse for washing your hands in the water fountain. Do you not even care that the people could have gotten sick or killed if they were to drink out of that filthy water fountain? Sock puppet Amravati, for washing your hands in the water fountain and almost giving several people the taste of your own medicine, you are grounded for the rest of your life. Go to your room right now and think about what you just did to the water fountain at school today. Ichika, how dare you get fired at school for putting your hands onto someone else for no goddamn reason. Yeah cousin Ichika, what has gotten you these days like this? Can't you just straighten up yourself for once like your parents and us cheer girls said. But cousin Sakura and Yui, Maria, Liliana and Melody Amble, it was an accident. Don't play your innocence on this like the teacher. We heard about what happened today at school and we are very crossed with you. For kicking someone in the back that caused you to get fired from school, we are going to put you on a check for what happened today and be humiliated by everyone else to see how you kicked someone in the back. And on top of that Ichika, my autism and I will make this clear and to say, for getting fired and for kicking someone in the back, you are grounded for the rest of your life. 
Go to your room right now and reflect on your actions on what you did to someone else at school today.